Welcome yet again to another fun, exciting week of us playing Magic and you watching us for some reason. Um, this week we are playing Planeswalker Showdown. We decided since, hey, Planeswalkers are become le uh, becoming legendary anyways with the release of Ixalan and probably Wizards is going to tie in some sort of commander rule to let Planeswalkers be commanders with it. We decided, why not just get a jump on it? Um, and if we do get it right, then we did it first. So take that, Commander Clash. Welcome to the stream, I suppose. Uh, let's just kind of go around the table right quick. Let's talk about our decks, and then we will begin. My commander is Garut, the Apex Predator. Um, he does have an ability that can destroy a Planeswalker as a plus. It seems, seems decent. I don't know. I think it might come up. And then uh, I can make 3-3 three, three black death touch beast tokens. Or I can just straight up murder something and gain life equal to his toughness. And the emblem is uh, whenever th uh, I give an emblem to somebody. Like and then whenever that job. person gets attacked, the creature is just massive. So here we are playing uh, green black kind of rock control sort of reanimator ish. Um, I don't know, it's just kind of a basic rock deck in terms of like mid-range and big efficient beat sticks. That's kind of my deck. What you got, Nick? Ray, I have Nick Lo Harlan? Oh. Harlan. Nick Harlan. Harlan. Yes. Thanks for thanks, thanks for thanks for instantly uh, doxing you. Alright. Yes, exactly. <laughs> um so yes. I'm playing Liliana of the Dark Realms and she, you know, tutors for a swamp, so I have basically just a core lash deck that I'm running so it's gonna just be tutoring a bunch of swamps, a bunch of swingy X spells, and a lot of you know creature kill stuff like that. It's pretty straightforward. Not much to say. Yeah. <laughs> I like <laughs> Excellent. what you got. Yes. Good Ooh, job. I guess I would Jay, be next in line. Jay pay me, oh. I guess. Uh, we like what you got. Getting swift. Yeah. Thanks. Good job. <laughs> Good job. We like what you got. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I'm next in line. I have a Johnny Mentor of Heroes. Wow, Originally, I was going to build Duretti Iconoclast, the really sweet red-black planeswalker from the last Conspiracy set. And I got most of the deck together, and I realized it was just sort of like artifact control, which I feel like I've played a lot of the last couple of times. Artifact control, artifact combos kind of... A thing that I do a lot, and I wanted something different. Yeah. So I switched over to one of my other kind of boo decks. Um, I used to play Earl the Miststalker a lot, and enchantments have always had like, especially auras, enchantments have it really had like a special place in my heart. So I haven't done it much lately. So I switched over to a Johnny Mentor of Heroes, really for his middle plus one, which lets you look at the top four cards of your library. You can reveal an aura creature planeswalker card from among them and put them into your hand. So he's sort of like my number one draw engine for getting me creatures and auras to really go berserk with. And that's at least the scheme behind my deck. He's the only Planeswalker, so that little last part about grabbing Planeswalkers isn't going to have much effect today. But you could easily build a really, really sweet Planeswalker deck with him. I think we also had a gentleman's agreement to ban doubling season, so that was a reason I didn't yeah, do I, the Planeswalkers. Yeah, I did not include doubling season. <laughs> that was kind of... That, yeah. that, was, that was a good call on our part <laughs> to not have doubling season. But yeah, that that's the rundown on my deck. Hopefully, I'll get to minus one or minus eight and get a hundred life. That'd be really sweet. Um, but yeah, that's my Johnny Mentor Heroes deck, and I'll pass it on to Nick Rowe. Docs him. Docs Let's count go. two. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I originally thought about playing uh, God Pharaoh Nicobolus, but then it was like, well, I've played so much Grixis like stuff, and Time stretch, Mystic Retrieval time stretch is boring. Um, so <laughs> I decided to play the X version of Nissa because you can get a lot of value off the zero ability and green blue creatures is fun. So I agree. Yep. Yeah. I was going to play, I was very close to playing the uh, blue green Nissa and I kind of I looked at our little Facebook chat thing and then uh, Nick Fruit Pebble decided that he was like, yeah, I'll, I guess I'll play blue green. And I was kind of went, Oh, <laughs> so, so then I just decided I'd play a Planeswalker that can kill Nissa as a plus ability. So, I'll have cool. my sweet revenge. 
So uh, added random things. Doubling season with New Samet as the commander would be sweet. What is New Samet's ultimate? Oh, you I go. Do, I do not know. Planeswalkers. You get to go search for two creatures or planeswalkers, put them right into play. Yeah, that'd be pretty good. <laughs> doubling yeah. season. I mean, doubling season is just fundamentally broken, anyways. I feel well. I feel bad for doubling season because it's not doubling season's fault. It's planeswalkers' fault. Doubling season was first. So who's going first? Is, is everybody good? I think it's Barack Elite. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Broco, 1337. Okay. <laughs> Unsurprisingly, start off with a swamp. Oh, I forgot to draw. Yep, still start off with just a swamp. Already missing the triggers. There we go. I yep. think I got my volume up now. I think my volume was down accidentally. Oh, my bad, gotta, everyone. It's my turn. Yeah, I was playing... I was, uh... Look at me go, Gold fishing. Man. Uh, I'll pass to Nick. Goblin deck last night. Yeah. And I was just not drawing for the first turn. So I just have, like, that muscle memory. Yeah. yeah. It's kind of hard to remember. Yeah, Abby, it's Brocco as in broccoli. That's why he has the picture of a broccoli with nah, I'm pretty, pretty sure it's Broco. This is the 1337. Bro Broco. It's, it's like I'm. Almost a Broncos fan, but just kind of. <laughs> but you stepped into like, Denver. Whenever, once. You're, whenever you're such a raving fan, Xbox. you just mistyped it. <laughs> you were so excited for Broncos football, you just got oh oh it's two C's. Yeah. So anyways, I just totally steamrolled over what you were gonna say. What were you gonna say? Oh, just how everybody mispronounces it on Xbox. But that's that's it. Death. Anything special? Death <laughs> Death. Okay. See what we get. Yeah, I'm not allowed to be a Broncos fan, Abby. I live in Seattle, and they beat the Seahawks. So rough. Yeah. Do I wanna? Mm, yeah, I wanna. Mm, no, I don't wanna. I'll pass. <laughs> Turn complete. <laughs> Sorry about that. No, I just I don't know if I want to run out my creatures yet without having like good auras to put on them. So I was kind of tanking there a little bit. Still yeah, annoying. Barry. Doubling season. I mean, doubling season was good, obviously, because tokens were huge back then. I think they were they were bigger than they were in Return to Ravnica. Um, but doubling season was unfortunately made before Planeswalkers existed. Mechanically, anyways. Yeah. And so, and just, just bro. and now they're now they're just totally busted, in half, which is why that card is like, there's too many planeswalkers that can just ultimate. Yeah. Come into play. Yeah. Like mono blue Tamio comes into play. You're like, hey, guess what? I just played omniscience for five minutes. It's like, well, <laughs> it's kind of weird, like how many planeswalkers there are now. Thinking back to like. At least when we started playing, uh, like Twilight Mire, any planeswalker printed, even like the bad ones, they'd have like a planeswalker price memory of like fifteen, like ten, fifteen or more dollars. Yeah, even if they were fucking garbage, they'd still be around like that ten, fifteen dollar mark. And then they and made enough like, bad planeswalkers to yeah. the point where people are like, "Oh, okay, they can be bad." You could just I think walk it down to the they card printed shop. Tibbled. Yeah. yeah, Tibble was like when everybody realized planeswalkers could be bad. No, because the original Chandra was. Bad. That's, That's true. Six drop one. It was a late red red. Like yeah. Good. Because she would then like play and kill guy. Like parasitic and bad. Leonard, I like what you got. Good job. Good job. Leonard. Leonard. O Leonard Omayoli. Yeah, look at you, Leonard. Leonard. Oh, uh, you're up. <laughs> Greg. Oh, hey, it's ready. my turn. Yeah. I don't know what I was doing. Um, it's Craig's turn. Craig likes his turn. Yeah, Selesnia, Selesnia definitely had the Tybalt is good considering he is a two drop. Uh, let's. <laughs> I don't know if I want to no, go no, no. into my fourth T Tybalt debate today. <laughs> Tybalt is good because he has draw a card printed on him, right? Basically. That's how that works. Oh, God. Uh, we're going to put another planes into my hand. So those are going to be the two lands I grab. Okay. And then I'll pass to Nick. Tibble seemed really good. Like I remember like there was that that Freet stack. It was like Mardu Freets. Oh god, it was like four color reanimator. Yeah, and it like used Tibble because looting. sometimes Tibble yeah. could be good. Um, and I'll plus two. Seems good. Yeah. 
there's so many so much salt from back in those the days. planeswalker text is so small it's itty bitty I like what you got. a bunch Good of tiny job. little ants running around Mike Sands. Like ants. We like what you got. Good, good job. job. That's getting good better boys. at that. That's actually good. We should all good. do it at the same time. We should just good. like court. <laughs> just... Good job. <laughs> <laughs> that was sexy as hell. I'll cut that out in post. Yeah. That's not going to be there in this yeah, YouTube no, video. No, you're not going to do that. You're I'm not going to do that. that. <laughs> I am. S you called it, man. You know me. <laughs> what? What is that? The. Uh... Uh, I'm trying to remember that episode. It's been it's been a few months since I saw that episode. Let's get some burnished heart out there. The Almighty Head they had taco <laughs> nights, and like they had to grow the potatoes in the front yard. <laughs> I'll have to watch that again tonight. Uh, perfect timing. Yeah. Hey, uh... Oh, hey, look at you. Yeah. You with that planeswalker. Convenient. Oh, she only costs planeswalker. four. I always forget yeah. that. She's a really good card, and her art's really cool. If you look close in the background, you can see all the like these screaming spirits that she's like coming out of her hands. That was like a really she's a really underappreciated planeswalker. Swamp to the hand. I still don't know if I like the art though. The art's weird. It's like that same weird she looks, Chandra art. She looks Czech. Yeah, she has like a weird long face. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why I think that or why that would be a bad thing, but that's just what I feel. <laughs> I don't know. For all of our Czechoslovakian viewers out there, <laughs> sorry. Look out. Sorry. Zach has your number. <laughs> I'll play it, Johnny. Um, let's see. He comes in with four. Uh-oh. Four. And then we are going to go ahead and plus four to look at the top four. Let's hopefully I don't reveal my library. You... That Johnny was really good in standard. Yeah, it was. Yeah. I played like a you centaur tribal four. deck. Abby misses a Johnny in standard. Yeah. Yeah, I do too. We have the six mana one. He's actually pretty good. There just Top needs to be a deck where he Anne. fits in post rotation, I think. We're going to reveal yeah, an cool. angelic destiny. Because if. Oh. Ooh. Ew. Uh. Bottom. What? <laughs> Y'all knew this was going to happen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Move the rest of the bottom. My deck's and... less. 15 bucks. Apparently, Mentor of Heroes is like $15 or something. I mean, it yeah, makes sense. If you're going to build, like, a Planeswalker EDH deck, you're going to have yeah. him in there. Because he's one of the only Planeswalkers that can dig for more. Yeah, we'll we'll pitch. Yeah, digging for Planeswalkers is pretty supreme. And I'll pass. We should like, be getting another one in the back half of Ixalan if the leaked packages uh, are true. Another Ojani? Hmm. Leaked packaging? I don't know if I've seen the packaging yet. There's been a lot of leaks from Ixadron. I'm kind of I'm kind of just over leaks. To be honest. Plus two. Yeah. I'm like over spoilers. <laughs> I've been spoiled out. The spo like spoiler out. The You've spoilers been spoiled by spoilers? <laughs> basically. Weird. Like, I feel like I can't keep up with magic sets. Like, I still haven't updated my cube or bought any of, like, the last commander stuff. So. Yeah, I don't know. It seems like stuff's just coming out so fast. Now. Yeah, the, like, change to the set paradigm is, like, crushing me under magic cards. Yeah. I don't know. I try not to get excited for like the little like modern masters, iconic masters. I try not to like yeah get hyped for those spoilers because I don't have any hype left for you know like real magic cards that are new. Yeah, I get instead of just kind of hype money reprints. I, but oh shit, I'm in pay two life. Okay. Kind of want to look at your hand now. Someone's oh man, getting, getting someone has a cryptic command. Damn it. <laughs> uh, all right, that land. How Zach, much is... whatever you play, are you ready to get plasma captured? God damn it. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. No. I guarantee it. Uh, I'll pass. <laughs> uh, Barry John says, uh, back when Wizards actually showed off the package image as part of a survey they did a few months ago. I heard about that, but I did forgot to look they at it. They accidentally <laughs> showed off? Yeah. I remember hearing about that now. You sure they weren't like just all... mock-ups? No, like, they just, they goofed and, like, posted a bunch of stuff. Huh. Because I remember yeah. they had, like, um, they were like, what, which of the following would be a good set name? And back then, the second set to Ixalan was called, like, Conquest of Glory or something. Hmm. And that's what it actually was in development. And they, like, said that name. But apparently, like, nobody said they liked it, so they changed it to Rivals of Ixalan 
after I have Ixol. an extra planar lens. Dope. Sounds pretty good. Alright, I'm going to imprint the swamp. So now my swamp's... Not play uh, snow covered. You suck. Whenever bro. a land with the same name as the exile cards. Oh, so Zach, you would also benefit from tapping swamps. Yeah. I would. As soon as I go fetch them with my burnished heart. Right, Value. Like someone isn't playing snow put snow covered swamps. Do I get a jet medallion? Um. I guess so. <laughs> I get the feeling he doesn't. I'm not looking at his hand on purpose because I want to be surprised. But I get the feeling Look he has Nick, nothing. The real control player. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. If I was playing right. Nissa, I'd just play like fucking Eldrazi. Put that in my hand. What I can reasonably do. Ixalan has been really bad with unintended spoilers. Just bad luck all around. Yeah. Um, yeah, like the guy that stole the sheets and stuff like that. Yeah, they like released two articles on Wizards. Yeah, uh, like the Wizards homepage that was like, let's talk about the theft that happened, and it was all yeah. like, it was all like alleged theft, alleged yeah, this, alleged that. That's gonna be it for me. Sweet. Because the guys actually like, the apparently the dude like went to jail for it. They talked about like it, you know because it's Pretty it's insane. intellectual property theft. Yeah. Um, which is a big deal, and they like said that the 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 hit to the company is worth, you know, just an incalculable amount of money. So, Plus a Johnny again. And then the dude also went and tried to sell it, too. So that was, like, another set of laws that he busted in half. To the bottom. Wasn't that how um, they ended up finding him? Was yeah, he, like, went, he went home and just fucking posted on eBay. He tried to sell the sheet. So they contacted eBay. They're like, who is this? He stole our shit. And they were like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> they're like, yeah, here's, here's his address. And they're like, oh, that guy. Uh, you guys, we gotta, we gotta kill some guys. What? Well, um, <laughs> give, give me a turn. What? Wow, so mean. I'll play yes. Enchantress. So rude. At, okay, whatever. Clear. I don't have a counter spell. <laughs> I knew it. Damn it. <laughs> oh, yeah. uh, I just want does. factor fiction. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Jesus, that just hit the side of the board. Everything's gone. Oh, hey. Oh, jeez. You should let me decide your fact of fiction. I'm really good at it. Um, sorry, I forgot about that. I think I'm probably the only person that's not good at fact of fiction at this table. Guys, um, smaller. Yeah, go ahead, Greg. Why don't you no, fact No, don't, uh, yeah. don't tell him you're bad at it. It's, <laughs> Nick knows the, I'm bad at it. I'm ploy. literally the only one who will give you the cards you want. <laughs> don't just <laughs> tell him that. Um, do, can you I'll pass over here and Oh no, they don't pass right. Um, let's see. You could make the stacks and then just transfer those over, like, or whatever. Mm, oh, there we go. Don't put okay. Eternal Witness and Metamorph together. God. Oh, you mean like this? No. Don't do that. <laughs> don't make piles like this. Oh, maybe I won't make. I'm piles gonna read like your that. hand if you don't. Go. <laughs> Look at me. Look at me making piles. Um. Hmm. I mean, eternal getting witness. getting eternal witness in a factor fiction pile is just a total it's just a total crapshoot, anyways. So yeah, unless you were scrying and you knew it was coming up. I mean, the only problem is like what no, I, I mean, you metamorph with because it's either two Simic Sky Swallowers or two eternal. Witnesses. I think eternal put witness it, is worse. No, put it with. Um, I'd almost do like Ewit with two lands and force him to buy back the other stuff draws him out more yeah you, you can't yeah yeah that's probably correct just put ewit with the two lands yeah because i mean he's not just like jamming ewit and sky swallower next turn you know that's true i am think i'm gonna do the piles like that so which one do you nick uh throw them back on my they'll they'll reshuffle well I you can them, you just move them one at a time yeah yeah there we go look at that go look at me i like it. the eternal witness yeah. 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 Because then you can just factor fiction again. <laughs> and also just get all those cards back. Yay, factor fiction's a fair magic card. It's a fun magic card. Isn't that like one of your favorite cards? Mine? I just like yeah, doing yeah. factor fictions. Oh. <laughs> I just, I don't actually like play it. Because like know. Sphinx of Luthun was like your bay. I'd rather wow. just draw five cards for four mana, which you can do. <laughs> I don't know. Sphinx of Luthun is a sweet card. I do like Sphinx of Uthun, but just because it's fact of fiction on an abusable inch of the battlefield trigger. Yeah. And when I'm I... gonna blind zero Nissa. Let's see what I got. I like oh. what you got. 
Look at the top. Ooh, Trigun card. Predator. Um, if it's a land card That's... or a creature card with converted uh, mana cost. You need to throw Factor Fiction in the graveyard. Oh, oh. thanks. It's a way to kill the uh, Jet Medallion and or the Explainer Lens. Yeah. yeah. Get, get, <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, take out Broccoli. Rarely does a Trigun Predator get a land and an artifact in the same blow. That's so much uh, fun. I'm gonna... Just... No, nah, that's mean. I'm not gonna do that yet. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> okay. I, I saw it. I looked. He's got so many counter spells. I didn't look on purpose. I saw it out of the corner of my eye and I know the art. Oh, fuck. Gilded so... Lotus. And then... Okay. Yes. I Eternal Witness the Factor Fiction. Woof. Yeah. Look at him go. Uh -oh. Land. oh, there you go. <laughs> Look at him go downtown. Wait a little screen right. back there for a bit. Okay. Uh, I'm going to... Magic. I'm just going to... Magic is being had. Break the heart. I'll find two swamps. Because they tap for double this... mana this turn. <laughs> Ixalan. I feel like Ixalan, we were talking about this earlier in the chat, that Ixalan is just sort of like... It is what uh, Battle for Zendikar should have been. Like that, it feels more like Zendikar than Battle for Zendikar ever felt like Zendikar, and, and it's really sad. Kapow. Like this is the exploration block we deserve. Nice. Yeah, I was. We were talking about that earlier. It was like it. The Battle for Zendikar failed on at like three or four different levels, but I think the biggest one is it just didn't feel like Zendikar. It felt no, just like some set with like a bunch of weird creatures in it. There was it there was like awkward Eldrazi the set. There was like none of the exploration. There was none of like the, the quests were gone. There was they no allies. Like they flubbed allies so hard. Yeah they made allies but they made them suck. There's like two good allies and yeah. one of them is the commander. Rally was really good. Rally fixed the problem with allies, which is cool. And then but in the second time, they printed cohort and they fucked it all up again. It was like oh yeah, I was it. thinking of cohort. Oh, Co cohort it. is just a garbage mechanic. Cohort is hot garbage. Like I have, I have an ally deck at home, and uh, there are zero cohort cards in it because they're all so bad. They don't even they're not even good enough to come in and trigger ally cards. Oh, I have it. I have two extra mana because I have swamps and you have extra planar lands over there. Hey, yep. hey, yes. hey, hey, hey. All right, so I have one, two, three, four, five, hey. six, seven, eight, nine hey. mana. That's that's actually much better than I thought it was. All right, let's tap these for mana while they still tap for double mana. Uh, we'll do one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, play Nissa's Revol uh, Renewal. Nissa's Renewal. So I'll gain seven and I'll find three bases, put them into play. Uh, I should have played that card. Yep. I didn't know it was a card. I'll just find three swamps in case uh, something doesn't happen. <laughs> Seems good. And then... Ben, and I'm done. All creatures are getting minus three, minus three. <laughs> yeah, I didn't play oh. any creatures. Oh, <laughs> minus three, minus three. Oh, target creature or all creatures? All oh, creatures. Oh, oh. See, he loses three. Toxic Deluge, uh, is a, if you haven't checked, it's a good card. I checked for you. Yeah. Um, it's a good card. Got wrecked. It's a really good card. It's also like $10 because it's a legacy. Yeah. Uh, it's like a cyborg thing staple. for legacy. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, I was waiting for my turn, making my way downtown. Do, 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 do. Nah, 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 do, all do, right. Do, 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 do. I'm done. Now I'm on. Down, bow, bow. Na, 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 na. I might start my album this week. Plus, sing a Johnny. That sounds like a good he's idea. He's a cat. <laughs> That's what you do. I'm getting gassy. Um, ooh, dope. I hope uh, that means you drew gas, not. Oh, a little bit of both. You're just gonna. <laughs> yep. Little bit of both. This hand's about to start sucking for me. I feel like I have to take. Uh oh. Uh, you top three. Got to fix that. I didn't put him on the bottom. Hi. Move to bottom. Okay, we're going to take the Rancor. Okay, no one's going to counter my stuff. I'm not being pretentious. Should I just find know. it interesting. The card's actually called Rancor. Yeah. And, like, it blows me away. Because when I say it, people look at me and they're like, you're a fucking idiot. Shazam. And I'm just like, I'm just trying to be smart. <laughs> Shazam. Boop. That, that all happens, right? 
Uh, 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 wait. Uh, huh, I don't know. Hang on, wait. Let me think about this. I'm tapped out. Yeah, well, regardless, I'm not. I, I can't really do anything. Mm, no. Lame. <laughs> I'm gonna putrefy your titan. You still get to draw a card, but yeah. And I lose my ranker. You do. Lame. Okay, I guess I'll pass my turn. Oh, again. don't say it like that. That sounds weird. Lame. Let's just no rank ranker. It sounds rancor? weird coming from someone else. Yeah, just call it ranker. Rank rank. Rancor. Rancor. <laughs> then like Luke cuts it or something like that. And it's then been Luke, a long Luke time. Skywalker stabs it in the belly or whatever. Yeah. I think that's why everyone called it that. Oh hey, Kilroy seven two six. How's it going? We like what you got. Oh, he didn't sub. He just said hi in chat. Sorry. Or follow. Like follow. Wait, what? Nothing. I'm messing up. Are we not allowed to like people? No, we like people. Oh. We just like them more when they follow. <laughs> or at least I do. That's up to you guys. I like you all just Nothing the way you are. Followers. Plus Nissa. Look at. Oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really? You should minus six and kill Liliana. And a Johnny. Except he just plussed. Yeah, I guess, After basically. After you find a way to play Chain Veil and tap it. Right. I wonder if there's I'm a Chain Veil in there. Can you untap with that? I'm playing no. Chain Veil. Your mom's playing Chain Veil. It's not... <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> it's not only good, but, like, it's flavorful with, with uh, Groot. Yeah, no, it is very flavorful. But, like, why would Groot have the Chain Veil? We're gonna um, get into nerd he alert area. found it. Oh yeah, yeah. That's my story. I'm sticking to it. I think if we're doing flavor magic, then you should probably be attacking Nick right now. Cause that was really I. Cool. I was literally I was like looking at some cards that have like Groot flavor text. Oh, it's my turn. And um, I was gonna put them in just because Groot's in like the flavor text. So that was it. And then I remembered yeah. that like I involuntarily vomit whenever I play magic just for flavor. So then I really, yeah, yeah. I decided against it. Kicked a little bit in your mouth and decided not to. I I can't. I can't. Um. Oh God! I bet Nick has some sort of counterspell. Oh yeah. I can almost guarantee it. I'm so sorry, Nick. <laughs> All right, let's drop. Let's drop a land. Uh, I have a shitload of mana though right now. Jesus, I got. Yeah. That's You're welcome. Ten, tons of mana. I got sixteen mana from the extra planar lens on my on your swamp. Nice. Um. Yeah, seems good. Let's let's do that. I'm listening to a lot of Deltron thirty thirty. Uh, I'm like my jam this last week. One, two, three, four, five, six, what seven. What do you guys usually listen to out there in chat? Let's go, Garouk. Lame. I'm going to plus one, and I'm going to target Nissa Steward of Elements. Why Nissa? Wow. Because if <laughs> I don't, you can <laughs> minus six and just fucking kill him. Oh, my God. And you... <laughs> I don't have to kill him. <laughs> I'm going to fuck with everybody else, too. It's cool. Oh, correct. That extra planner lens is, like, going away next turn. Don't worry about it. We're good. He's making made enemies out. Are we, I guess we, I guess we know who's dying first. Are we saw? Are we, <laughs> this made it is how it happens. I do it to myself. I don't. Uh, all right, one, two, three, four. Green. Two green. Five, so seven total. Three green mana. I'll play a brawn and a Nyx Weaver. Brawn and next Weaver. Yeah. He's so brawny. He's the quicker picker. He's, he's so cool brawny. <laughs> I want a, brawny. That's the one with the lumber. I want an altar of this card. Anybody out there who alters cards, uh, hit me up in a in a whisper. I want an altar of this card with the brawny lumberjack in the art. <laughs> I'll send you the card <laughs> the straight up. I'll send you like five bucks because that's all I have. But like, yeah. Um, and then I think I'll be done. Wait, what does Nick Weaver do? I didn't actually read oh. it. I just put it in. 
Uh, he you for two, and then you can regrow. At the beginning of my upkeep, it, it puts two in. Yeah. Okay. End of turn, we're gonna consume the meek. Destroy each creature. God damn it. CMC? Oh, okay. Three or less, yeah. Um, duh, I can't. Duh. Oh, yeah, you can't sack next oh, weaver for I the regrowth. I can't get rid of it. Correct. I get to keep brawn, at least. At least I have a blocker, I suppose. Oh, wait, you can, you can, you can go crazy swamps right now, can't you? Me? Yeah, you can you can lake of the dead all your swamps. Oh no, it's minus yeah. six. Yeah, look who chose the wrong person to kill. Uh, whoops, my bad, Nick. Yeah, I think so... you just lake of the dead here. I think that's what. You yeah, think. we're gonna ult Liliana. Because that's an insane amount of mana. Because it's doubled, so that's like what's that? It's quadrupled. Four, five. So six, he gets so six. They, just, they have the ability to tap for four. Oh right. So it's like then, tap for then they get an extra. Yeah, each, each swamp lens. taps for five. Yeah, that's pretty dope. We uh, well that was quick. Yeah. <laughs> Whose fault is it? Yeah, uh, just remind our viewers out there: we are a casual but still goodish <laughs> tapped out commander series. Uh, yeah, welcome we to know the how stream. To play cards, kind of. Uh, so that's one, two, three, four, lose. five, six. Where we lose. Six times five, so thirty mana. Yep. Torment Abby. of Hailfire for twenty eight. <laughs> <laughs> Repeat the following: each player, each opponent loses three life unless he or she sacrifices. So we just lose, right? We lose. I think. I think we just lose. He does it for. We don't lose. His... Oh, I, I can factor team. You'd have to. Five. You'd have to discard or sacrifice. Fourteen things, or else we all die. Yeah. I have I think to we all just die. do fifteen. 12 things. I mean, I'm super fucking dead. My bad, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. Factor fiction finds nothing useful. Okay. Find your counter spells. Find your ramp. Uh, repeat the following. There is some Each ramp. There's also a Genesis life. wave. That would have been fun. <laughs> Resolves. So, I mean, Resolves. we could survive. We're not like dead, dead. We're just 28, right? 28 it's, times. No, no, it's, uh, yeah, you have to do it 28, 28 times. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Zeet Loop says, uh, GG. <laughs> and I can't agree more. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, well. Let me see. I might, I might still be in it. <laughs> I have nothing. So, You're not, Greg. Right. Even if you sacked everything. How many permits do you have? You, you have could get rid of seven things, so, you'd, three, four, so five, you would seven, get hit with 21 six nine, times. Nine, 11, 12, you'd take 13. 63. Okay. Non land well, permanence. Oh, non land permanence? Never mind. You can't do it. Oh, yeah. I thought you could get I could rid of seven lands. things. You would take 63. Way to go, Zach. What? <laughs> I knew <laughs> I should have plowed under Nick. I didn't die first. <laughs> I was last in turn order. I died I died last. Screw you guys. So I got so second concerned place. concerned about my enchantment creatures. Second place. <laughs> uh, well, <laughs> let's, uh, let's go again. <laughs> The infinite void. <laughs> oh god, no. Just my face floating in the void. Basically, we have a swamp too. There's a swamp which there. is exactly how I feel every day when I wake up. <laughs> um, Alright. Hey, we're back. They get to see us cheat with hands. They do. <laughs> we we aggressively sort of we, fake mulligans. We, we aggressively cards. cheat mulligans. <laughs> That's it's bad. I actually didn't bonkers. aggressively cheat my mulligan last time. I... Did a snap keep. This hand is. See, that's the worst part. That hand was like somewhat keepable, and I still am just like, fuck it. There's better hands to be had. <laughs> I want to point out, I rolled a 175. All right, I'll keep this. Whatever. Are we? Are we? We rolling? I guess. Uh, you, guys, I, you, you guys need to roll. To Greg goes out. first. Because Nick goes last. <laughs> but I rolled Wait. a 175. But I don't Greg know. Just what did I roll? Two. Oh, <laughs> Greg shit. rolled a two out of 200. <laughs> I'm gonna continue to cheat face mulligan. What happened? What, what did I... Oh, did I roll? What happened? Uh, 150. All right. I guess this works. Nick goes first. Nick. Cockatrice uh, has, like, Nick an food. aggressive habit of mana screwing everybody. Oh, hey, Josh is there. We'll see how many times I can dox you guys. Zach died first. Uh, he goes first. I actually died third because I was last in turn order. I died... Technically, I, I was last. the last person to concede, so I, I took second in that game. So. Uh, Nick conceded first, then I conceded i didn't die first i'm not accepting that one <laughs> that was not me didn't happen 
Okay. Uh, how does magic work? All right, let's play that way. Oh, I'm going land. End. Hi, Josh. We like what you got. <laughs> I'm just gonna say that to everybody who joins the chat. Did someone go infinite and kill everyone? I just showed up. Uh, Nick ultimated his Liliana and all his swamps tapped for five mana. Then he played Hail of uh, Torment of Hailfire for yeah. twenty eight. Yeah. yeah. You know, just casual. Zach could have stopped it, but instead he found six six he lands. Wanted to kill Nissa I, I killed yeah. Nissa because I'm spiteful and wanted to play Nissa. <laughs> <laughs> that's up, so. like, that's the real a reason. Guy there ready to ultimate. Better kill Nissa. I was. Oh, hey, it's I, turn. I don't know. It's I don't Greg's read. Turn. I don't read magic cards. That's not what casual but goodish uh -oh. players do. All it takes to be good at magic is reading cards and years and years of experience and advanced logical um, strategy okay. skills. But so that's going to the bottom. So far, cockatrice is not wanting to give me land, so I'll pass. <laughs> Oh, Cockatrice. You can put as many lands as you want into your deck, but if you get a two-land hand, two lands is all you're going to get. I'm like, I'm really afraid that that's going to happen to me right now, because I only I'm have one more land. I'm convinced. Yup! <laughs> uh, I mean, I have a thing, but like, it's, that's kind of, there's not much else happening. Sometimes I do the back, but I haven't been. I do the back often. Okay. Uh... Kelsey's feeding the stray cats because I'm on stream right now. Oh, that. So, yeah. I was going to say, you play the back nine because I play the back nine like every day. All right, I'm going to pop expedition map and I'm going to grab a... As we lose all our followers. I feel like I should grab Kamal Coffers. Expedition and go with, map? Uh, oh, terrain generator. Terrain generator. Yup. I like what you got. <laughs> Is there actually someone that subscribed with terrain generators in him? Because that'd be dope. Oh no. <laughs> He's <laughs> like finally too real. <laughs> six years. <laughs> You're up. Oh here. god, it's my turn again. Abby okay. says, essentially, she's casual but good-ish at card alters. That is, she says, I should qualify. I have altered cards, but I rarely do anymore. I do, but I'm bad and lazy. Hmm. That's exactly the kind of altar I'm after. I don't want photo right, quality right. Brawly Lumberjack. Brawly? Brawny. What's Brawly Bra from? Brawly's from like Brawly's from Family Guy? Dragon Ball Z. Okay, I think I'll... Man, Cockatrice makes me nervous. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's watching. I, well, I think if I if I was playing a regular stack of magic cards, I probably wouldn't worry as much about drawing a land next turn. Where did this cricket but... come from? Yeah, we just got rid of one too. Oh but I'm God. not sure, like I have the Sylvan Reclamation that can land cycle, basic land cycle. And I'm not sure if I want to do that just for fixing or if I want to play some cards and see Shoot. where it goes. I think I'm just going to play cards. Go away. I'm going to play this guy, the uh, Herald of the Pantheon. Uh, it's a 2-2. It was from the Last the uh, origins, or, origins, right? yeah, origins, and it was it kind of escaped Theros, which is really sad because that would be sweet if it was an enchantment creature. <laughs> it makes me enchantments cost shit. one less, and whenever I play an enchantment, I gain life. So I'll pass to Nick. I almost feel like Origins was was their way to put a bunch of cards into a set yeah. that were too good for their own blocks. Yeah. It, like, and then they kind of used it as an excuse to go back and, like, make the backstories for Planeswalkers and stuff like that. Yeah. Which is why you get planes like Theros in Origins when none of the Planeswalkers came from... Kithian came from, from there. Gideon. It came from Theros. Yeah, but he sucks, so it doesn't count. <laughs> I played him last week. I did not win anything. Yeah. I like what you got. I like what you got. What, Jer? Thank you. Getting swifty. We like what you got. We like Good what you job. got. You gotta get swifty. Gotta take off your pants. <laughs> gotta get swifty in here right now. I found our land. Shit on sort of. Gotta get shifty. Swifty. Get shifty. <laughs> Just yeah, get real shifty. Um. I like what I got. 
Uh, we forgot to watch the new Rick and Morty. No, they were, they were skipping today, right? Because yeah, there, there wasn't one. Yeah, that's right. I remember hearing that somewhere. Let's get a swamp, and Name. uh, for yep rest. Uh huh. I'll put the um. Hang on, I don't know yeah. which one I want to put into play. I don't think it matters. I guess I'll put that in to play tapped, and I'll play the forest as my land for the turn, and I'll pass my turn. Yeah, Barry John gets it. He knows that Kithius. Kithion is from my. Kithion Eora is from Theros. So the story, and I'm sure I'm going to get corrected by Barry, no less. The story of how Kithion's name became Gideon was after he like pissed off Erebos and Erebos was like fuck you I'm a god and Kithion yeah, was like oh yeah I'm friends. just some kid and then like Kithion just like shit his pants and that's what ignited his spark to travel to Bant and then he like landed on Bant and he like looked up and there is some some just crazy sigiled motherfucker on a Leo town and he rides up and he's like hail what is your name stranger and Kithion was like my name's, my name's Kithion and the guy was like Gideon and he was like yeah fine <laughs> <laughs> It's Craig's turn. That was exactly how it went down, and anything sure that anybody right. says in the chat is wrong because that story is way funnier. Oh, yeah, look at me drawing cards. Good job, Greg. I'm impressed with myself. Um, <laughs> Barry says it's accurate. <laughs> I'm validated. I'm done. <laughs> so I'm, I'm good. Gonna, uh, Thank you for showing in as lore master in place oh, of yeah. Josh this week. And play this a little bit different. I'm gonna play that. So. Let's see, whenever... Yeah, close enough. Hit me, dog. We're going to play Sigarda's Aid. My so I can ready. play Aura's and Equipments as those add Flash. And there's an Equipment Clause at the bottom. <laughs> but I don't play any Equipment, <laughs> so that doesn't matter. Barry! Um, oh, he says, take your only win today, Zach. <laughs> oh, poor Zach. We're, yeah, we're on the same it. team, buddy! <laughs> Come on! on top of it. Um, I'm going to go to combat and attack Zach for two. This is... God damn it, Barry! <laughs> I'm going under the hood and I'm deleting your next article. <laughs> Man. Yeah, there it goes. This is... um, <clears throat> um, uh-huh. Uh, we're just going to get this out there right now. We're going to make him indestructible. So, we're going to play that. Good. It's done. Okay, Real good. Turn. Did you gain a life? I just did. From... Sigarda's aid also? I uh, did not. Good. So when I kill you from forty two, it's gonna be that much sweeter. <laughs> yeah. I got it. I got it. I figured it out. Greg dies first. Says the person dying first. Now I've done it. Yeah. Now I've done it. Well Nick has Nick has a reason to attack you to be fair. I'm just uh, just following. I just appreciate Nick that dies that first. everybody else is like <laughs> just like I won the game for like an obscene reason. And everybody else is picking fights with Zach. <laughs> Zach Thank you! This is a three. <laughs> and I'll plus. I like what you got. I like what you got. S Rook, good job! I haven't seen it come up yet. Good there it is. job! Good job. Get that timed in. Wait, how do I put magic? I'm done. You don't. Just pass the turn. I know. <laughs> That's every week. <laughs> Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven mana. Schnazzy. I like it. That's prime Nissa killing mana, Nick. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That's I'd a be, big Nissa. I'm such a dick. A um, don't stop fucking with me. I'm not even gonna do anything scary. <laughs> why did Nissa become blue? Does anybody know why Nissa became blue? I never uh, that, because she was oh. like, oh, I remembered how to think for myself. Uh oh. Neat. I'm pretty sure. Best that that's not so. My knowledge on that is not as accurate as how Kithion Eora got his name. Um, Barry John probably knows though. Yeah. Let's let's elemental bond. My hand isn't that rude, Josh. And then let's tap four for a brawn. Brawn, and I'll draw a card from the elemental brawn. bond. Bonus. So brawny. Hey, got a land for my turn. Doom, Value. Doom, 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 doom. There it is. All right, and done. Nice. Nice. Going right along. Oh snap! 
If Josh is in chat, that means we can play D&D right now. No. No, it doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, Jesus. That's, that's where my mind is. Our session today was Josh and Emily and Kelsey, and <laughs> they, uh, they boarded a ghost ship and fought a ghost, and Josh punched the ghost with his, with his key beads because he's a monk. I'm going to play Liliana on plus her up to four. Let's go. Get and it, son. Grab a swamp. Dude, I almost put Cabal Coffers in this deck without Urborg. Because uh, I was like, I bet Nick's going to play uh, Urborg. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to put Urborg in this, but I was like, I feel like giving Nick Urborg is way worse for me than just having more black mana than I know what to do with. Uh, hmm. Thanks for joining the stream, everybody. It's good to have you here. Play my Viridian Enchantress. Uh, go ahead, hit that follow button if you feel we are delivering top quality service, which or medium quality service. Yeah, medium quality service. To be recognized. Three and a half star home. quality service over the kind here. of service you get when you order a steak and you order it one way and that comes just slightly another way. But it's, it's like, like it's not enough to raise a fuss. But you're yeah. just you're gonna eat it anyways, but you're not gonna be psyched about it. Yeah. Like the outside's just a little bit cold, but the inside's still warm enough that you know it just got cooked maybe a little while ago. Yeah. So give us uh give us a follow if you enjoy undercooked steaks. Um, Basically. We that's that's the whole point of that spiel. Uh we uh I like what you got uh, and the pow Zeet loop getting what? swifty that's with undercooked Nisa. steaks. Or, uh, we like Lily. what you got. Yeah, pow pow Zilly. Lily. I'm gonna do some damage to her. Okay. And then I'll let my turn pass. Uh, She's a little bit scary. Josh says, does anyone have any questions about the personal lives of any of our players? I know them all intimately in ways you could not possibly imagine. <laughs> <laughs> Conversely, does anybody know does anybody have any questions about Summerside's personal life? Uh, he is he is Josh when he plays on here. Yeah. He's one of us. I could tell you a lot of stuff. I could tell you a lot of stuff. I can tell you where he works. I can tell you where he tell sleeps. You. He lives in my old apartment complex. I know where that is. I know where his apartment is. Oh, man. Uh, Frost Titan. F tits. Damn well, it. I don't know what's in Josh's. Uh, uh, Frosty uh, tits are the best tits. Good job. I, I keep terrain checking. OBD, Ariox. Thank you for the follow. Thanks for supporting undercooked steaks at restaurants. We really we like appreciate it. Got. We like Good the steaks. Job. Uh, I zero Nissa. Your steak is somewhat adequate. <laughs> I don't get my card. Good job. What are you freezing down? Sorry. I'm I froze down yes. terrain generator. It's just like oh, make okay. sure it doesn't go crazy. Fair. Cool. Um all right. Let's play magic over here. Huh. That's a that's a card. Um, maybe I just, duh, hmm, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight mana is not terrific for much of what I've got here. That card's going to make me way too big. Yeah, we do. We're playing I'm easily twice. three turns away. Um, it's, it's good. It's got its, it's got its qualities like it's free. Six, seven. I'll play the Apex Predator, and I'm just going to plus make a beast. I'm not going to fuck with anybody too hard. Well, BD, you're not asking about, like, guessing what's inside Josh's belly button, because that's just, like, he just tells us. Yeah, you don't have to guess. You just be like, what? He'll be like, it's a carrot! And I'll be like, oh. <laughs> God, I wish. Uh, draw a card from the Elemental Bond. <laughs> God, it's a I, I remember, I, I remember <laughs> Josh just showing up to Cab with... Uh, just like whole cucumbers and just like munching on oh, that yeah. through F and M's. <laughs> just a giant English cucumber. Yep. Yeah, I saw a guy in the store that was just walking around Safeway and just had like uh, I'm uh, just like Josh, just like an English cucumber in his hand, just like eating it, just walking. God, Josh loves cucumbers. Let me tell you, we'd walk into cab, he'd just be sitting there just just chewing on it like a fucking beaver chews on logs, and we're just like, what are you doing? He's like. <laughs> 
It's cucumber. <laughs> I'd be like, well, I know, but like, why are you just eating a cucumber? Like, I know it's food, but people don't just usually do that. He's like, well, they're just good. I don't know. <laughs> so, like, <laughs> next week, Terrible. I think we, like, all went and bought him cucumbers. And he, yeah. we, and as, like, a joke, but then we gave them to him, thinking Aww. we were just going to be assholes and tease him. And he was just like, thanks, guys, I finally have <laughs> friends. And we were like, oh, man, we fed the stray dog. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, wait, no, I need to plus Liliana. Uh, I love you, Josh. I didn't think of you as a stray dog. Uh, stray dog. It just it just added to the story. I'm sorry. And then I'm done. It is healthy. It's full of water and fiber. Josh also loves Swedish fish, too. I remember that. Uh, Swedish fish are so good. They are. That's fair. I, like, Fuck I gummy can't... bears. Swedish fish are are the prime candy. Uh, vessel. Well, Josh started working at my wife's company and then on his first day I had my wife drop off like a one pound bag of Swedish fish on his desk for him and it like made his fucking day I would love that but I would also die because I can't stop eating them no. once I start I don't buy candy at all from the store I, I used to buy like the big like the seven dollar bag of glow, glow bright gummy burns glummy worms I can't yeah. glummy burns glummy burns um, and then they'd be gone in like three days. Yeah. Uh, so <laughs> same. I just I I feel like such a fat ass when I eat them. It's we bad. bought the biggest bag of Cookie Crisp and we just like fed off of the bag of Cookie Crisp for like three days. That's what Kelsey was saying. Kelsey was like, "I've yeah. done nothing but eat Cookie Crisp in three days." We've been trying to keep like sugar and like milk out of our diet, and then we just bought a bag of Cookie Crisp. But like, fuck it, and we just like <laughs> killed ourselves. <laughs> That's a good point, Josh. Freeze your candy. It's almost always better. Except if it has peanuts in it. Yeah, Then it is not better. Yeah. I do oh, like, I do like a good payday bar, though. I got a sweet spot for payday bars. They're so salty. Clever. How do I make a, do I make a token that's a thing of a thing? You just right-click, make a token, and then you can just type in the name of the card you want to make a token of. What are you making a token of? Is it the I'm, I'm Clever Impersonator. It's a Frost Titan. Okay. Oh, did you play Vizier this turn or last turn? This turn. I just played it. Oh, and you're using zero to... Uh... Yeah. Not bad. Look at him go. Yeah. Oh, I guess... Oh, if you were doing that, sorry, you could right-click what you want to make a copy of and you hit clone. That'd be an easier way to do it. I thought you were just wanting to make some random token. There we go. <laughs> um, And then I'll tap down your... Well, I won't kill Garrick. If you don't kill Nissa, no, that's fine. Fuck it, I'm I'm done killing Nissa. <laughs> I actually want to <laughs> see what she does because I wanted to play her. So I I, I uh, got out of my system now. I just want to see what she can do. Then I'll tap. Uh, yeah. well, I'll tap. I don't know. I gotta figure out this kind of thing. <laughs> my head's just all over the place. I gotta like figure out a way to get into one of the left hand boxes. So my I guess I'll move. tap. The Death Touch Beast. Yeah. Get it? Boom. And then... This is happening. We're keeping the terrain generator tapped. Correct. Do you guys know Frost Titan's a really good card? I hear I hear it's pretty Did you know that card was like two dollars when it was in standard? Oh yeah. It was like the control finisher. Everyone control was like, though. This this Titan's garbage. And then Wolf Run yeah. Blue came out, and everyone was like, "Ban Frost Titan." <laughs> There's like a blue black control deck, like way, way back, like around Cobblade days. Like yeah, before Cobblade got big. Before and was it was like that. before it was like right after Scars came out. Before yeah. like when all we had was sort of body in mind, and it wasn't worth doing. Yeah, Frost Titan. That's was what like it was. Big finisher, he Frost Titan it. was the bomb. They played like one Grave Titan, one Frost Titan. Yeah, and they crippled yeah. you so bad on resources because that was like a Jace the Mind Sculptor control deck. Yeah, and they just crippled yeah, you, you and then you like, played Frost Titan and they had no hand anyways, so you just won the Blade and Mana Leak, and you're like, "This is fair." Oh man, I got these these cards stacking up. Shit, I should probably play some of those. Yeah, but, you guys have so many more lands than me. I, I missed a land drop. I cultivated. But... Yeah, that's true. And yeah. I've somehow that's managed true. to hit my land oh, yeah, drops Nick, every turn. Nick yeah. Waddell's. You guys got things. Zach, Zach managed to cast Garuk on turn four, just before I cast my Liliana. Was it? And, and yeah. Oh my god, it was. I uh, Soul Ring does that, I guess. Okay. Yeah, I hear it's good. My bad. 
Uh, all right, I have three green sources. Oh, Grave Pact. That yeah. might determine what I do this turn. With oh. my zero creatures, it's pretty good. Yeah. So Actually, I have a fair up. number of creatures in here. I just keep not seeing them. Uh, all right, let's yeah. plus. We might. I mean, I forget. I get to draw a card. Let's do that. Let's like... keep the game moving forward. Here we go. All right, draw a card from Elemental Bond from my Beast. That does nothing. Cool. I have all my reanimator spells in my hand and nothing to reanimate. Um. Then I guess the other good option is I'm gonna play the chain veil. Lame. Gross. That's a flavor fail though. Can't put elephants on. Can't put those boots on that elephant. Can't have Garuk using the chain veil. He's already cursed. That's just wrong. Yeah. Okay. I'm done. I think. Oh, you're not gonna use the chain veil? No. I mean, I, I like make a beast, and then he goes up to eight. But then he just gets attacked like fucking crazy because nobody wants an emblem. Yeah. The cool. emblem is actually really cool in multiplayer because you just give yeah. it to someone and you're like, all right, everybody have fun. Go kill him. <laughs> that would make you not lose first, though. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> uh, let's play a swamp. Hopefully yeah. that was the longest turn I've taken. All right, I'm going to mute my mic and then I'm going to put the sock on. It'll be hilarious yeah, to watch. Do it. Put that sock on there. No, uh, actually, I need to attach that. So I'm going to one, two, three for an extra planar lens, which I will imprint. Yeah, we all got swamps now. Yeah, but it's it goes by name. Oh, uh, lame. And uh, then I'll tap four for okay. a all right, Lash Wraith. Make a token. Lash Wraith. Let's put preview box over here where there's no cards. I'm smart. I am like great smart. It's a 5-5 right now. Uh, we'll attach Lightning Greaves to it. Oh, shit. Oh. And... Uh, wait, hang on. What does Lash Wraith do? Oh, it just gets it's, plus one, plus one. Plus one. Plus like swamps. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you do you have great pact. Um. Um. Okay, that's fine. All right. Oh, Lash Rifle is like a finisher in a weird black deck with Phyrexian Obliterator. Oh no! Fuck! I can't do what I thought I was gonna do. Rex. Yeah. What I thought you were gonna do? Swamp to my hand. And well, it was something that I thought I might have to do, but I realized I can't do that anymore, so this play Craig's turn. I should have just tapped out on my turn. Craig's turn. But damn. Shazam. Look at me go. I'm making stuff happen. Sorry, I'm moving these over. There we go. And finished. Okay. <laughs> Josh says... <laughs> um, Spork said, so you can freeze your candy. And Summers, uh, Josh said, and my cucumbers. Yeah. Um, Sporks said, do you actually freeze your cucumbers? No, but you can. It turns into a vegetable popsicle. Since the cucumber is mostly water, it makes for a really interesting eat. <laughs> Sporks says, have you actually eaten a frozen cucumber? And Josh says, <laughs> dot, dot, dot. <laughs> <laughs> dot, 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 yes. As if we all do weird stuff he's sometimes. insulted to be asked such a, such a glaringly obvious question. We're going to plus it, Donnie. Flicker form. And we're going to get flicker form. Flicker form. Flicker form. And then I'll pass again to Nick. Things are getting weird. Things have been weird for quite Things a while. Things have been weird. Zach, your swamp taps for two now. Oh my god, that's relevant. That's actually really good. <laughs> but only the swamp, because extra planar lens goes off of name. Yeah, yeah. that's way card. better though. Yeah. That fixes my problem. Good call. I like what you got. Good play. Uh, the card picture box moved again. I just can't keep that thing nailed down. I don't know what to do, guys. Uh, kill Zach. Boy. Yeah, I, I concur. What? I'm sure that's a default. <laughs> I'm not. Also, I'm gonna try to get. I'm gonna try that's... and get to Garrick Emblem, but I'm not gonna give it to you. So I'll plus Nissa. No, that's good. You don't want it. <laughs> uh, you can you can 
attack me? You're, you're kind of just in that position where like you you have good attacks. I guess you could attack Nick and try to. I don't know. But he's got a German. Gonna... He's gonna make us sack guys. Yeah. Anything's gonna make us kind of sack guys. You have a guy to sack. You have a. Wood I else? guess I do have a guy to sack. I okay. don't mind getting rid of Braun. I will uh, plow under Urbog and then Correct. Reliquary Tower. Wow. All right. Swift Justice. Someone's getting a trip to Pound Town. And then... Fucking plow the... under <laughs> such a savage card. Yeah. Jesus. So your guy, your germ's a 2-2 a two -two now, right? No, 3-3. Three -three. Terrain generator's a land. Oh, Lash Wraith is oh, a Oh, no, it's Sturborg's gone. Never mind. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. So then uh, I'll get in with my guys. And I'll tap down your two swamps. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. Uh, All right. Let me... Uh, you want to reorder them, right? Yeah, I, I want to draw Urborg. You top two cards. Fucking plow under. I think it's your turn, too. Zach. Oh, are you done? After that? Yes, I'm done. Okay. Okay, let's plus up. I'm going to... I'm just going to make another beast, which will draw me a card. The from, neutral play. From the uh, elemental bond. Who's gonna hey! Zach, okay. Zach, did you sack a creature to... Yeah, I don't think so. Great Pact? Last, yeah, Great Pact. On next turn? Oh, you lost your germ? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'll sacrifice Brawn, then that's fine. Yeah. Um Yeah, <clears throat> so I drew a swamp. Now I have you still have the planar lens? Yeah. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven mana. That's a pretty significant amount of mana. Uh let's go with Chain Veil? Lame. Yeah, let's, I'm just the negative Nelly today. Let's crank the chain veil, tapping that swamp for double black, and I will use the ultimate ability of Garrick Garuk. Gary Rook. And I will make an emblem. Boosh. There it is, boys and girls. And I will give it to. So I even shift entered, and it's still like dumped me up. Hang on, I got it. I tried. I'm gonna give it to... Okay. Broccoli is 1-2. Black Rabbit is 3-4. Fruit Pebble is 5-6. Ready? Here we go. <laughs> Here. <laughs> Suck it, nerd. Oh, did you put it on? Uh, so, oh, wait, I got it? Did you zoom yeah. your webcam or something? Huh? Did you zoom your webcam in on the, the roll? Oh, no, it was three. My bad. Oh, okay. I guess I could have. That would have been way more <laughs> dramatic. <laughs> Cinematography is not really where it should be. Uh, now I just have, like, D20s everywhere. Okay, so, uh, so you get the emblem. Plus five and trample. Yeah, which is pretty yeah. good with that touch. I'll just leave that right there. And then I will play um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Shieldred. She costs. Yeah, she got seven. And she has Swamp Walk. I always forget that. Um, well, I'm not going to do anything. Up on Nick. I'm not going to do anything. <laughs> I'll pass the turn. Alright. I need to draw my Urborg to play a Swamp. I need to Terrain Generator a Swamp. Tapped. I need to plus Liliana to draw a Swamp. And then I... I'm done. That's all I got. Okay, let's see what I get. You have to sack a guy, Greg. Oh, do I? Oh, really? There's a shieldred out. Oh, God. If you need a future okay. opponent's upkeep, that player sacrifices creature. Welp. 
Nick, you didn't have anything, did you? No. Turn? Okay. Kind of a weird double edged sword with Great Pack <laughs> and Shieldred. Mm. Reveal that. Huh. Yeah, the Shieldred is a problem. <laughs> yeah, it'd be nice if I was drawing any of my board wipes or creature kill or anything like that. But yeah, uh, huh? Guess we'll e wit. We'll get back. Mm, I kind of want the enchantress. Marmalade. Hmm. I'm not crazy about marmalade myself. Let's see. It's too weird. Uh, I like I like orange marmalade. It's tasty. I think we're gonna get the Herald back, maybe. I can't cast both. I'm just gonna get the Herald back because I can actually cast the Herald right now. And we're gonna cast the Herald. Score! And then I'll pass turn. Nice. Let's see your turn, Nick. Uh, thank you for joining us. If you are here with us, we really appreciate it. Whether you've come from Tapped Out or you're a loyal follower on Twitch or you just happened upon our stream, thank you so much for being here with us. Go ahead and hit that follow button. That way you're notified when we do go live. We do go live every single Monday night, 6.30 p.m. Pacific, um, or roughly 6.38 p.m. Pacific, which is what it usually is because I'm terrible at time management. Go ahead, hit the follow button. Um, tappedout.net is our main sponsor for the tapped out commander series as one would hope and uh, i personally have also just started the tapped out standard stream so we've done a few test streams this weekend we haven't really gotten our feet off the ground but we've already gotten up a, a pretty uh pretty modest player base pretty modest fan base i should say um followers so um if you're interested in that i will set up some linkage in the chat that way you can go and follow that channel and be notified when that one goes live as well. And that'll be starting to get more serious as the week goes on. I'm plusing this uh... Resolves. Wow, that sounds really interesting, Zach. I will totally check that out. Wow, fantastic. Did you know <laughs> that... Hang on, where's my... Here, where's my... Screen? <laughs> Did you know that Amazon Prime gives you one free Twitch Prime oh, subscription for, ever, for each... Uh, for each month. Oh, yeah? Yes. Please, Greg, tell me I'm more pleased about that these you have inquired. Amazon Prime subscriptions, because <laughs> I know as a Amazon Prime uh, subscriber, I did not know about this uh, fantastic thing that Amazon does. Oh, yes. It's, um, it is phenomenal. Phenomenal, you say? <laughs> How could it be that phenomenal? Uh, Please tell me more about the benefits that both you and I receive from Twitch Prime subscribers. <laughs> I'll, I'll keep trigger. Zach I will get like... Braun back. Woo. Man, we're so much fun. Yeah, hit us up with a follow, guys. We're too much yeah. fun not to follow. Who the fuck are you kidding? Yeah, I am a real-life <laughs> human and not an actor robot. <laughs> tell me more about the enjoyments of twitch prime i'm such a garbage human all right one <laughs> two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven i wish these beasts gave me devotion uh. i just use prime to get dice to my house faster for D. &D. yeah we all use prime for for not prime things yeah. also when Braun comes into play you draw another card i do sweet Ooh, perfect now that i just took one of my delirium pieces out of the graveyard i'll play traverse sylvan wall <laughs> I don't think I have any way of dealing with Shieldred. I think I have a Swords and a Path, and that's it. Seven? I'm hoping I drew, or I'm going to draw something different for Relevant. Yeah. Okay, so I, I let's got rid of start Reliquary Tower. here. Yeah. Pay enough mana for the the Whip of Erebos. The, the Whip? Zach whip of Erebos? Crazy. What? What? I said Zach's going crazy. Oh, yeah. That's just it's it's. I think I might be dying. It's just going off. Uh, all right, let's hit. Yeah, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
Grave Seven. Titan? Eight. Oh, jeez. Because fuck it, why not? I'll draw a card. Oh, it was a swamp! Nice. I'll get some zombies. This is just know. one zombie, I suppose. Oh, God. How do I how do I work tokens? Uh, if you right-click on Grave Titan, it should give you an option. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, value. I'm actually kind of curious how Zach is going to lose this one first. I don't, I don't believe I'm going to. He's pretty far ahead, but, you know, that, that hasn't uh, stopped him before. Uh, okay, so... <laughs> Just gotta could, uh, kill yeah, Nissa and then. <laughs> yeah, that's basically how it's Time to down. kill Nissa! <laughs> Alright, so we have three mana Everything open. I like that. So, let's just go to combat. And I'm going to. If you attack me, I'm gonna start telling you about Call Me Shuffle Skin from. <laughs> yeah. I used a random name generator for half elf, and it was like combi shuffle skin. That's actually yeah, we we I used really don't a, want to. a manly yeah. name generator Eight, for like random NPCs. Thirty two, uh -huh. and one of the like the first one we got was Buff McBlast Cheese. God, that sounds great. <laughs> Buff McBlast Cheese. Yeah, so there are some pretty quality names. Uh, the best thing we had today, we had Greg, a... take thirty eight trample. We had a uh, death touch trample, no less. We had a uh, oh you oh you weren't dead. Yeah, I'm dead. That's close enough. Okay, resolves. I like what you got. I Good like what job. you got. We had a fart <laughs> roll off. Thank, you. Thank you. I'm trusting I'm saying that correctly with the correct inflection. Thank you so much for joining the stream. Uh, I will gain. Uh, 36. No life because Greg scooped. What? Yeah, take that. What? Here we go. Yeah, I conceded before I died. You guys are, the, are literal. Spite. Yeah, you guys are the little Pierce worst. Spite. <laughs> now you can gain life if you want to. <laughs> I don't oh, know. my stuff didn't get tapped. I'll, I'll still find yeah, a way to die. Let's be real. I need to draw. Uh, I guess that's something. I'm gonna play <laughs> Herborg out again. <laughs> Spork said, I follow you guys, but I don't think I ever got the animation on the screen. And Josh said, we like what you got! I yelled it at my wife for you. And Spork just said, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so let's play Kiku, Knight's Flower. Oh, that's an interesting there card. Go. I'm going to... Oh, I only need to tap one of those. Equip Lash Rife to her. And then I'm going to equip Lightning Greaves to her. Plus seven, plus seven? One, two, five, six, seven, yeah. So, oh. Is not bad. Eight. We'll plus Liliana. Crap swamp. And I feel like my deck's too fair. I don't know. I'm done. You had all the right cards. You were playing a lot of stuff that I was gonna play if I had that deck anyways. I just like I don't know. I did play my Planeswalker on turn four. And then found a Chain Veil to get him to ultimate. How much ramp were you playing? Maybe you just needed more ramp. Maybe you need a little more ramp. That's always my solution. When I have an EDH deck that sucks, I just add in more green cards. And it usually gets better. <laughs> <laughs> it works! I wouldn't do it, but it works. That's good deck building. On, on a related note, come watch me play the standard series, <laughs> where I build all my I own decks. So I tap for seven. I minus six her to untap two of my lands. I tap them for mana, and I write a replication kick on uh, Grave Titan. Uh, it's in response. 
I'm going to have Grave Titan deal damage. You're not going to kill Shieldred. He's just going to get the Grave Titan back. Yeah, but I don't want you to have... <laughs> we have five Grave Titans. Nick fight. Here we go. Uh, actually, you know what? No, fuck it. You you can have your Grave Titans. I'll kill Shieldred. I was going to say, I'm I'm pretty okay with Nick just getting a shitload of Grave Titans. That makes yeah, this game really interesting. because I think my only out at this point in general is, is just us like killing each other. <laughs> or just a damnation. Nick, ah. gets, Nick gets five Grave Titans, ten zombies. Not I bad. To, I need to do that at the end of... I don't even have a fucking out to that. I just wanted to see it happen. <laughs> I'm fucked. I can't do anything. I'm, uh, I think I'm done, because I, yeah. Uh, Is this just where Nick wins? Are these cards, what are these cards? These. Um, it's too long. It's too much. Is it too oh, I guess I, take I can that. move those over. There we go. Okay. Um, I, well, I guess I could have done something. I just wanted to see it happen, though. I could have responded, but that's a lot of fun. Okay, let's just go to my turn. Huh. Oh, did, okay. Well. <laughs> I don't think I have an out. I definitely don't have one in my hand, at least. <laughs> What's my delirium count? Two? Perfect. Um, problem solving. Woo wee! Let's see if I Look have an go. answer. <laughs> All right, so you I'll have I'll answers. have one floating black, and I'll play Gerard's orders, and oh, I'll yeah, go and put going. a creature into my graveyard and put a creature into my hand. Gerard's orders is one of those cards I just kind of wish was a little bit better. I don't. It's always know. Been I don't know. It's pretty yeah. good. Search your deck for any creature and put in your hand. Yeah, it, it is like super good, but I've always just wanted it to have a little bit more. I don't know. Like it's always just barely not made the cut in some decks, or maybe I just don't play those kind of decks very often. I don't know if there's anybody in chat that like. Do you use a lot of Gerard's orders? Is that a card that like really shines for you? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I mean, it's like buried alive. Yeah, but then you also get to put a card into your hand. Yeah, I think it's. An, I, think I think actually, Drive's orders is underrated for what it is. Yeah, remember when it came out, people were freaking out about it, but then it just never. It never really. I mean, at least in standard, it was just garbage. Yeah, because, I think I might just have, like because it wasn't Sphinx's so. revelation. No, it's four yeah. mana for effectively a do nothing card. Yeah, I don't think I have anything in here that can stop the swarm. Uh, let's. Uh, okay, I'll get. Seems bad. Um, massacre worm. Do it. God, why didn't I put that in here? No. Yeah, you got Jod's orders and no massacre worm. What happens that? Damn it. Massacre worm. All right, I'll get. Uh, I'll put a hornet queen into the graveyard. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And what is good for three mana here? What do I do? What do I get? How do I play magic anymore? All right, I guess I'll get a fight bear into my hand. Yeah. Okay. All right, so Hornet Queen goes into the bin. Fight bear goes to my hand. I will... Yeah, when Sibby... Mimeoplasm is a sweet card. Makes a lot of stuff fun to play. I will play the fight bear. You have to Nick, use... you used to have like a big Mimeoplasm deck. That's sorcery, right? that, like, that's, that's basically just the pre-con, and then I slotted in like 15 or 20 cards. You were using Death Shadow before it was cool. Yeah. I have a signed one, which I don't know how I got that, because I don't remember meeting the artist. And it's I, not like a big I'm name artist this all wrong, but I'll pay two... I'll pay the one floating black and a Thought Vessel for Nykthos, and I'll add... Four black mana to my pool, and with that, I'll activate the Whip of Erebos to bring back the Hornet Queen. And I'll get four bugs. They're insects, right? 
Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're just like yeah. flying insects with death touch. You can also right click on Hornet Queen. It'll <sighs> never make those. God, I always forget that. We kind of we had that conversation. Yeah, that happened four minutes ago. Um, all right, screen's getting out of control here. Let's save that a little bit. Uh, I guess we can like stack up some of this shit. Okay, there's my bugs. Did you take your damage from Chain Veil last turn? Uh oh. Did Did you use your Planeswalker ability or? No, he didn't have a Planeswalker. Oh, I guess I didn't know. Good call. Right. Uh, now I have five mana still. And. Uh, I'll kill Nissa. <laughs> <laughs> Signaling the okay. end. Yeah, I only say that because I'm just gonna get just steamrolled by like a hundred power, regardless of all these blockers. Um. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Take Gerard's orders off the stack as well. Attack Nick. I have too many blockers to get through. Nick can't kill another Nick. That's uh, not how this Hornet, world works. Hornet Queen should be exiled, right? All right, yep. I don't know. I haven't played Whip of Veribos in three years. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yes. That was the card that I needed. Uh, crap. I believe in you, Nick. Stack the beasts! Shut up, Josh. Uh, I'm going to stack the beasts. Bring it on. I wish Fight Bear had haste. Everyone wishes Fight Bear had haste. Yeah. God, Fight Bear is so good in EDH because no one wants to just blow a path to exile on it. Isn't he, isn't he a guy, though? It is a human. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a guy. human shaman. But the bear is just so psyched to fight something. The bear is stoked. He's awfully excited. For the longest time, I thought the art was a dude holding a rifle. That's uh, what yeah. I was just thinking. And like then I remember that guns don't exist in Magic. Yeah, he has like a weird, awkward giant sword. He's, he's like, fight, bear. And he's just holding it, and he's just like, go, oh, I have a sword, but you go fight it. Walking Atlas. I made a thing literally for killing things, but you go kill That's that. That's the power play. Walking Atlas. <laughs> 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 uh, one, two... We'll have a black floating. Play Obnixless. Woof. Plus Liliana. I see. I will play that swamp. Uh, Zach, proud of you. lose three. Dicks. <laughs> What's everyone's favorite movie? Know, says, why don't I move my face like over here into the void? Oh no, I've been in a long time. I was watching a really good documentary on Netflix about barbecue. That was actually really cool. <laughs> about barbecue? Wait, yeah, I think yeah. I saw that. It's really good. Like, it's a really good documentary about barbecue. I like what well, you got. Like, good job. It's just like it goes around the world and it's like, this is barbecue in South Africa and this is barbecue All in right. Australia. Jan Figueroa, <laughs> we like what you got. Thanks for getting swifty with us. Good job. Monday Night good Swift. Uh, my favorite movie is uh, Shaun of the Dead. Yeah. I love that film. That's so a pretty good, good one good one that's a pretty good one i don't know i would call my I, favorite movie i like that they marketed it as a romantic comedy with zombies <laughs> yeah my favorite funny movie is probably hot fuzz yeah that's a good one um, i love my my favorite feel-good movie is probably her i think yeah that I movie get to see her that movie was so well done like the cinematography, like it's like the vision of the film was was just like, just beyond anything else that came out, either before or after it that year. I think. I'll that go to combat. Technic. You are allowed to go to combat. Um. 
I don't have enough mana to respond to anything, so. <laughs> Mine might be Harold and Maude for movies. I had to write, I had like a, like a TV I feel like movie the only class. way I'm winning this is if I go after Nick. So I'll Frost Titan the Kiku and everything else is coming at you. I'm not going to draw all the arrows. Uh, okay. <laughs> you have response. to draw the arrows, Nick. And then you get ten more zombies. The arrows is the good part. That's the fun part. In, in response to the Frost Titan ability... Okay. Uh, we'll have... Zack lose three more life. Damn it. <laughs> uh... Six counters. And we'll activate Kiku and have Grave Titan fight itself. Shit. And you you gain six life off that. I'm trying it to win. Uh, oh, and man. then I'll have Obnix list block a or block the Frost Titan. Okay, and then I'm dead. D E D. I will regrowth Plow Under. D oh. And I'll well, cast. Put um. Well, shit snacks. Put your man land and uh oh, I lose forest on top of your deck. Because I didn't use the chain veil again. My man land and my forest. I choose the order, right? Yes. yes. Then let's go man land first. Okay, that's my turn. <laughs> so let's see what happens. All you right. You got lifelink, so. I do. I got a sh just a shitload of lifelink. But I do have like. 20 zombies. Oh, I was like, what did I draw? <laughs> wow, I'm so excited to draw cards. Um, yeah, you have so many zombies, but uh, I need to get... That's what I'll do. Yes. I got it. Got it. I think. One, two. All right, I have sorcery creature um okay land for turn swamps don't tap for double black anymore which kind of sucks because i'm gonna just have to play fair magic now um i think i'll just do this and i have four left over that is not fantastic i wonder if zach's gonna make it out of this one Probably not. I guess I can do the I can do the Uno announcer. One, two. Yeah, it does seem like indeed oh, that he yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, Zach is in the tank. Yeah, you know that he is sitting on Baltic and shit in his hand. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Nick. <laughs> I've, I've seen Zach in some. Actually, I haven't even looked at his hand. Yeah, I'll play, I've been watching this. I'll play time. Git Frog. You know, I've, I've seen I'll Zach draw... in some positions, but oh, this may be his most difficult. We'll see if he can make no. sense. Let's see if... You've seen Zach in some compromised positions? Oh, yeah, I have. He's <laughs> he's it's not Oh, I forgot to gain my free life. Oh, from your oh, from your worm. My life guy. Your lifelink yeah. worm. Zach plays a Git Frog monster. It's a 6-6. Six, six, I draw a card. I'll play and a second land for the turn from Git Frog. The, the bond. I'm so like fucked. Is that, is that, is that, is that. Tanita, last <laughs> quack, YT. Try, I'm probably, I'm really, I'm, I have to be saying that correctly. Thank you for getting yeah. swifty with us. Thank you for the follow. We like what you got. We Good like what you job. got. Good job. I'm losing. Um, one, two, three. Uh, way to make that followers following <laughs> all about you, Zach. It's always about me. Okay, um, well, I fucked that up really super crazy bad. All right, uh, did you draw? Oh, you did draw your card. <sighs> oh yeah, <laughs> this can't be correct. There's no way. That's 
All right. You just like those. Yeah. I'll tag you for two in the air. <laughs> sure thing. Well, he's got ten zombies. I'm not getting through those, and my death touch lifelink blockers are like way better than those. And I want, I need to have enough death touch on the ground to kill all five grave titans. So that was my my reasoning behind that. <laughs> it was funny and strategic. And I. Yeah, I messed this turn up really shitty. Oh no! All right, I'll lose two life from Is Zach gonna die? When will Zach win another game? Will our hero make it out to live the next time? When will I win my Tune first game next Monday to see the what happens from this? <laughs> You're so <laughs> good at anime. commentary. Yeah, I'm. I'm not a commentator. I'm better at rolling them dice and you're, seeing. You're better at Twitch Prime happens. scripts. Hey, which reminds yeah. me. Oh no! God damn it! <laughs> have you guys heard of Tuft and Needle? <laughs> <laughs> they they have no middleman, and yeah. they make mattresses real cheap, like me on these. They're made out of that breathable model. And <laughs> just every single podcast sponsor out there. Yeah. <laughs> I listen to way too many podcasts. Hey, have you heard of my favorite murder? No, no, I was listening to the last podcast today, and or a couple days ago, they're talking about the uh, what was that uh, fire in the sky that happened up around Snowflake? There was like some loggers that got abducted. By aliens oh yeah, got, there was like, a movie about that, wasn't it? Yeah, there, there was a big movie. There was a big thing. Like it's one of those like abduction stories that is yeah. like strangely true because there's like seven loggers and they all have had the same story for like the last twenty years. It's weird. Like, no one's changed. And the story's kind of cool, where like he gets abducted and like he gets like basically milked by Nordic aliens, but <laughs> yeah, that's me. <laughs> yeah, that's it's so weird they're... that a bunch of loggers went off into the woods with a bunch of beer and came back having all been abducted. <laughs> well, no, it was just one of them. Just one of them got abducted. He was gone oh. for five days with only enough memory of like two hours. Yeah, I tried to watch the movie, and then like partly through the movie, the movie, I looked it up on IMDb because I was like, oh, that actor or whatever looks familiar and then i i saw it was like based on true events and i immediately stopped caring about the movie <laughs> i guess i go to yeah. combat yeah get it nick those yeah okay um hoy that's 40 damage uh 46 that's true you got worms you got worms um you get that looked at Ron blocks death touch. Gitrog blocks lifelink. Of uh, zombie, zombie, I believe zombie. Me. Yeah. And uh, then before damage, you're basically taking no damage. We're gonna fight the frog on another zombie. So okay, so I gain six from that. One zombie dies. And then you have four teen unblocked zombies, right? Yeah. Okay. So let's just do damage to my face first. So I take 28. And then I gain back 9. Oh, God. 13, 16, 22. Yeah, I think you're going to be fine. So I go to, what, 50? Jesus. And then my zombies die, my brawn dies. Oh, jeez, uh, that's crazy, kill right? Yeah, that's metal. Uh, hopefully, uh, and then you lose things all right. Both worms yeah. and six zombies, and you gain three. God, yeah, you'll have to you'll have, were... to have to just kill right about the horse situation. Hopefully, everything is okay with it. House just got struck by lightning. Jesus. Oh, house. I read that as horse. Like, <laughs> I was like, God, that poor horse. I was like, what are they talking about? Oh, you guys. This, oh, yeah. I couldn't think of any thing? any better place to talk to you about this, but my horse just got struck by lightning. How's the game like, going? <laughs> well, yeah, I thought he had to go outside and tend to his horse. His horse just got stuck by lightning. That's a traumatic event. <laughs> Thank you. Um... <laughs> I guess I green sun zenith for Oracle of Moldiah. Oh, don't do that. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> I need to actually... Nope. Timmy's need... versus Timmy's.
if there's anything anybody would like us to Alchemist play next Refuge. week, oh, you got to shuffle in the green sun. Chat, like any, uh, you're right. Anything like that, let us know because we're we're definitely we want to make stuff that you guys want to see. So, did you play the okay. refuge off the top and then shuffle in green sun zenith? Do you want me to do it? Shuffle in there, okay? Yeah, because then you don't try to mastery. <laughs> Uh, I'm a I'm a dick. I got I got nothing. You're up. I think oh, you're gonna end up winning this. I think so. Oh. I just don't have enough mana to do stuff. Otherwise, otherwise I would have won. Yeah, that's definitely the, had, the whip. Definitely mana, saved me. I would have gotten uh, Eternal Witness and Plow Under, and then I have all the clones in my hand, and I could just plow under you over and over again. Yeah, but just, just plow me under, son. Just plow well, you so why, hard. Why didn't you attack with the Grave Titans there? They all die. Yeah, but wouldn't that... You'd give him like a billion enough. more zombies. Yeah, you'd get a bunch more zombies, and then he'd still have to take... You know, he'd have to waste resources blocking there. So you wouldn't have to deal with him still having you know, Six, an additional seven, nine, 11 two. power lifelink. Oh, I gotta blood. sacrifice a land for Get Frog Monster. And I draw a card. I guess. Huh. I don't know. I... That's interesting. We could even this game out. <laughs> uh. Okay. Yeah. But I'm also stupid, so. I'll. Uh, no, wax not. Yeah. Not, not yet. Stupid. I'll attack with We're, all those. They're changing up the Planeswalker rule, and it was just kind of came up as like, oh, that might be kind of cool if they add that to the commander. I'll take yeah, 19, I guess. In a possible future. Now okay. Planeswalker's now you blow me out with your post-combat thing. And, right? also have and I'll go to 69! Where it was like... Oh, man, it's the section number. It was perfect. That's why I didn't attack with Hate Bear. <laughs> uh, Planeswalker? So we figured maybe they'll switch it up. Um... Squibbity beep. Squibbity oh, bop, bop. Uh, yeah, there's a whip of Josh, Erebos yeah, in play, Josh. Yeah, the whip. Okay, then one, two, three, uh, four, five, six. No, seven, they haven't nine. confirmed anything. Yeah, we're speculating. Yeah, we were just. It came up as a potential thing, and it sounded interesting to do. So this is actually like. I feel like this is not. We're doing some experimental EDH. Let's. Oops. Oh, those are co oh, they have converted mana cost because they're copies of I'll the card. I'll post the deck list again. Balls, that doesn't do what to, I thought it did. Check. I yeah. was gonna gaze we, a granite your border away, really but cross that now that they're legendary, they'll mm -hmm. they'll switch it up and kind of add that planeswalker because uh, that'll be really cool. That may have been a bit hasty. It kind of, at least for me, I know when I got thinking about building a planeswalker as a commander, it really like opened up a lot of flavor doors that I never had before. Tapped things. Uh, solemn. <laughs> okay. Go get Swamp. I thought, yeah, I thought Gaze of Granite was going to be able to kill the Grave Titans, but I forgot yeah. they have CMC because they're copies of the card. Boo! Okay. This is bad. Okay. <laughs> I'm done. I think this is the right play. Fuck it. It's staying on the floor. I'm tired of dropping that thing. Man, I'm just never lucky. Hmm. Well, I guess I pay five to make a Nissa one. And plus her. I think next turn should be significantly better. I don't know how I forgot Massacre Worm. That. And I'll play that. Uh, value. It would have been even better value if it ended up being a creature. Yeah. For four or less. Oh, you also have Vizier. Damn. Yeah. Vizier plus Oracle seems pretty good. 
Yeah, especially when my deck is mostly creatures and lands. Yeah. Um, what do you? You just have to fight bear, right? Yeah. And six cards in your hand. Yeah. Whatever that attacks. Figures. Mm, Thirty. Maximum zombies. Fifty-eight damage coming at my face. We thought that uh, Nick was going to build something like that for a long time, just because he does a lot of mono reds, and I was kind of. I wanted to see Tibble DDH too. Yeah, but I just played mono red last week. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So I guess Solomon's going to block a Grave Titan, and four damage. I'm going to play Rescue from the Underworld. And sacrifice the solemn, targeting. Um, God, it doesn't even matter. Shelter does nothing. Targeting Grave Titan, I guess. So I'll get back my Grave Titan and my solemn next turn. And I draw a card from Solemn Dying. Rescue from the other world goes away. And I take twenty four plus twenty eight, so I take fifty. Two. Rescue from the Underworld gets exiled. Oh, it does. 58. 58. Yeah, 30 from the Grave Titans, and then... Oh, I, bl I, bl I, I blocked one of the Grave Titans with the Oh, true, true, true. Yeah, yeah, so 52. Yeah. Okay. And that's gone forever. So I'm um, 17. Yeah. And then uh, I make a clone of a Grave Titan... <laughs> I was, like, gonna get back to the Aldrin, and I was like, God, Grave Titan's just better. <laughs> Okay, you're up. All right. Uh, okay. Beginning of my upkeep, I am going to fish back the Solemn and the Grave Titan. I will get two zombies. Solemn resolves. Get a forest into play. Trigger forget rock monsters. Sacrifice forest. Draw a card. And draw for my turn. Am I forgetting anything? Oh, draw a card for Elemental Bond for the Grave Titan. Aha! Whoa! Whoa, that's, that's a good. card. That could do it. That could definitely do it. <sighs> okay. All right. Uh, land number one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's play land number two. We'll pick up land number one. Play Contagion Engine. Ouch. And I'll put a minus one, minus one on counter on all your stuff. Yeah. And just to be nice about it, I'll just proliferate so you can not have to worry about counters. I'm going to use the Nykthos for that, and that'll make one, two, three, four, five black mana, and it's four to proliferate, so I'll have one floating back mana. Um, and I have three. Mm, I'm going to use the black mana, spend two, downfall your living Grave Titan, your untapped one. And then I'm gonna just gonna fucking swing for the fences like a wild person with all that at your face. So I think it's twenty damage. Twenty, yeah. I like what you got. Good job, Eileen. We like what and then you, you got. Twenty. Thanks for getting swifty with us. Yes. Thylian, good Erebos. job. This was why Whip of Erebos was unbeatable in standard. Because <laughs> you'd be like, you take 10. Uh, All right, I'll hit you for 10, but I'll gain back to 10. It's like, oh. No, we're, this is Thylian, we're doing... Yeah. All right, then I'm done. Or do you mean the... Do you mean, Thylian, do you mean what we're playing on the client cockatrice or the kind of EDH we're playing? 
Oh, X Mage is X Mage is, is a rival program to Cockatrice. Okay. Yeah. I haven't heard of X Mage before. It's I think it's arguably more popular than Cockatrice, but I don't like the way it looks. Even less so than I do Cockatrice. Cockatrice is like not bad. Oh, it doesn't even look that bad. X Mage is interesting. Yeah. It's got the same tiny, tiny cards, though. It, like, is cockatrice with prettier backgrounds. <laughs> Build a deck, only cards with no flavor text. I'm so down. Yeah. <laughs> right. Let's see. Got all that. You have to... Nick, you should plug in your piano and start doing, okay. doing some stuff. You either have to gain a bunch yeah. of life, kill me, right. or kill two hornets. Oh, true, you got hornets. I have flyers. I just have Dead Eye Navigator up the top. So, uh, seems good. <laughs> but you're going to get me because you have the hornets. You don't have anything that can kill the hornets? No. Oh... Uh... So that's I think that's it. Otherwise, the Dead Eye Navigator would have been really good here. <laughs> yeah, you would have gotten your seventeenth Grave Titan this turn. <laughs> okay. Well, when since they're tokens, wouldn't they just disappear? Yes. Oh wait, they're tokens. You're right. They're right of location. True. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's true. You did have a Frexian Metamorph one, but I killed it. You did. That would have been savage. Ah, oh, hey this? Josh. Josh, guess what, Zach, buddy? Josh, Zach I just I just won a game. I lost this is, last. <laughs> this is horseshit. <laughs> Zandal lost last. Ah, <laughs> oh, sweet. If you stuck it out with us to the end, thank you so much. Uh, that means you you sat through the the grindy part of that last game, and you got to watch me lose last finally. So, um, thank you so much for being with us tonight. Hit that follow button if you feel we've delivered at least mediocre service to you, because uh, that's what we shoot for here at the Tapped Out Commander Series. If you are interested in watching Standard, I will be posting a link um, all over the place on Tapped Out once we get this uh, once we get this Commander video up on Wednesday. I'll have a link inside that article for my Standard series, and that's going to get started later on this week too. As always, thank you so much for being with us. We are here every single Monday night at 6.30 p.m. Pacific time. Uh, Tappedout.net is the place to go for all your deck building community and content needs. We also post when we are live there. So be on tappedout.net or hit us up with a follow. That way you're always notified. We appreciate all the support so far. This is episode 11, you guys. So thank you so much for being here through all of them, uh, even though we really suck at magic most of the time. Did you say you're welcome? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Classic. No, no problem, Zach. I got you. You got me. All right. All right. Um, so that's it. Then we're going to call it. Thanks for being with us, everybody. Have a good night. Thanks for being right, with